Hey y'all, the chosen one is here. Um, I don't really have a title of the video, but um, we're going to jump right into this thing. Um, for y'all don't know who I am, um, I am Bobby. I am um, a prophetess. I am a vivid, a biblicist. Um, uh, I study the Bible. I, I... I study astronomy. Uh, I really like astronomy. Um, I'm a fashion designer. I like, I, I draw. I'm an artist. Um, I'm a mother. <laughs> I'm a sister. I'm a sister to one brother. <laughs> um, but I really, I really, um, took the opportunity to help other people to um to get closer to God. I'm 25 years old, and I noticed that I've lived different lives. <clears throat> um, and that's when I realized that the concept of death is an illusion. We don't die. We don't die. There is no death. <laughs> I've been here many, many, many lives before. And I know... I know myself. I know my purpose now. I know what to do. Now. I know who I am. And, uh... I'm, I'm, I'm broken... I broke in past life curses, and that's why I'm here today to let you guys know, like, where I'm at, where I'm at with it. <laughs> where you at with it? <laughs> but, uh, uh, today, uh, I, I really don't have a title. I really, really, really don't have a title for real. But, um, I was in the book of John, um, John 1 and 14, John 1st chapter, 14 verse, if y'all have y'all Bibles. And it says, The word became flesh and dwelt among us. And we beheld his glory. And the glory as of the only begotten of the Father. Full of grace and truth. Which led me to 1 John chapter 1. And nine, in the ninth verse, if we confess our sins to cleanse us for all unrighteousness, it will be so. We have to put aside every weight because our weight hinders us from doing what God calls us to do. Those sins piling up on each other creates weight. It creates weight. And it hinders us from doing what God calls us to do. I don't know why, but 1010 is really significant in my life right now because I'm continuously seeing this number. 1010. John 10 and 10 says... The thief does not come except to steal, kill, and destroy. The thief does not come except to steal, kill, and destroy. The more God gives you, the more you're going to be tested. The people around you is to trap you. And I've noticed this today, ironically. <laughs> people are, people that I ain't listening. <laughs> let me tell me, let me, <laughs> um, let me tell y'all my experience today. Um, people that has never usually, usually on the day, I have few friends. I have a two or three or just one or a, 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 a 
it don't matter. It, it'd be literally less than four people that I would hang around on a daily basis. Literally, if you see me, I'll probably have one friend, one girl, and I'll have one guy friend that I really, 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 really trust. But people, other people that I haven't, that I don't, I don't really associate myself around on it. Feel people that I wouldn't really hang around on a day, want to hang around on a daily basis, hit me up today and was like, bro, you trying to chill? You trying to hang out? And I'm just like, bro, like, no, not really. Like, I don't really be going nowhere. Like, I don't really be hanging around that. I don't really be doing that no more. I don't, I don't indulge in that type of stuff no more. Like, I'm, my life, he, he has really seen, opened my eyes. He has really opened my eyes. He has really allowed me to see that the devil really is trying, bro. Like, ever since I turned, like, I've been turned to him. Like, I've been turned to God. It was just, it was just, I would turn my back. I would turn my back and not think that he would be looking. <laughs> but he with me all the time. So. so, but I mean, like, even when I didn't know that he was with me, I, I still chose to sin because that's what my, my, my flesh, that's, that's my flesh. Jesus. <laughs> But I mean, that's that was the old me. That was the old me, bro. But I'm 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 not saying that. I'm, I'm not saying that to say like I be sinning a lot. No, I really don't. Not no more. I've changed. I really did change my freaking life. Like, well, he changed. I allowed him to change my life, and that's why I'm here expressing this to you because I'm a different me. I'm a different Bobby. On the inside, my soul is my soul is showing y'all. What's really on the inside, bro? And I, I ain't never used, I ain't never used to do this. I ain't never used to like, even want to preach. Like, not nah, I, <laughs> no, like y'all don't even know. Like, <laughs> like God really had to step down on His throne. It's like, bro, you ready? We finna make a couple videos today. We finna go do this. We finna tell people what the. We finna tell people what's going on. I chose you, Bobby. Yeah, you. <laughs> Yeah, you. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um, <laughs> so, that's why I'm here. Because I'm an empath. And I really want to help some of my people. I want to help my family. I want to help some my friends. I want to help my ex-friends. I want to help the haters. I want to help <laughs> all the people back there. Who oh, y'all in the back. I see y'all. I see y'all. Yeah, I see y'all. I want to help y'all too. Because my God is good. My God is great. So what that made me right. Um Yeah. People hitting me up. The 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 people around you is to trap you. Yeah, people hitting you up, people hitting you up, I don't know what. They're gonna do that. Y'all don't never used to talk. Y'all don't never used to hang out. Y'all don't never used to do this. Y'all don't never used to go this place, but they want, they calling you to go do these things. And you like, nah, bro, you ain't never used to do it. You know what I'm saying? You ain't never used to hit me up, bro. Like, nah, I really don't feel like it now, bro. Now, I really don't feel like it. I really don't feel like going nowhere. I don't feel like going nowhere. I, I, I don't trust you to go to go do anything, really. I trust God. I trust God. <laughs> I trust God. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Um, <laughs> my, my, some of my friends would, would get that. <laughs> but they they not going to believe that I really did that on this video. But I had to do it. <laughs> um... <laughs> <coughs> Excuse me. Um, let's get back to this word. People with lack of faith, lack of knowledge shall perish. People with lack of knowledge shall perish. Not me. Um, <laughs> um, which led me to the book of Revelation. It led me to the book of Revelations. Um, uh, chapter twenty one. If y'all have y'all Bibles. Um. Verse 7 and 8. And it says, <laughs> He who overcomes inherit 
all things, and I will be his God. And he shall be my son, daughter. But the cowardly, unbelief, unbelieving, abominable, murders, murderers, sexual immorals, sorcerers, idolizers, and all liars shall have their part in the lake of which burns with fire and brimstones, which is the second death. <coughs> and I mentioned that in my last video. I mentioned that first in my last video. In the la in my last video. Yo, I read that verse in my last video. Y'all go check it out. <laughs> Excuse me. The second death. We all have to live in Christ daily. Mm. Yo, I got to tell the story. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> so, well, sometimes when people will be like, <gasps> like, I don't know where, like, <laughs> <clears throat> like, I don't know where. Because I remember I, um, I scared a really, 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 really good friend of mine and <laughs> I scared him because I because the Holy Spirit dawned on my soul like it dawned inside of my soul that he was right like I wasn't doing I wasn't doing what I was doing his spirit knew that it was wrong like his spirit knew that it was wrong and me living in Christ like me living in Christ I had to realize, like, like it dawned on me that I was wrong, like, that I wasn't really living life daily. I wasn't living. What I was doing, it wasn't of Christ. And I, I thought it was. I felt like it was, and it wasn't. And I was wondering why, like, why, like, why ain't nothing happening, guys? Like... <laughs> God, Jesus, why ain't nothing happening? <laughs> Wait. <laughs> like, you know. <laughs> and um, um, I told him that he was right. And I felt like that was the um, that was the one thing that was stopping me from. Um, I felt I felt different. I felt different. And I felt like that was the one thing that was really stopping me from um doing this. Doing stuff like this. Giving me the courage to get on camera. <laughs> Giving me the courage to really like put God's stuff out there. And it was making me do things. Not it, but the what I thought that was of Christ was making me like do things. Like think a certain type of way and it was not. It wasn't, that wasn't what it is. I'm just going to put it like that. It wasn't what it was now. So I had to stop. And now, look at me. Um, Let me get, let me get on with the word. Okay. In Hebrew, if y'all got y'all Bibles. Uh, in Hebrew, I wrote it down. I actually wrote it down. In Hebrew, um. 12th chapter, um, one, first verse, um, therefore we also, since, therefore we also, we also, since we are surrounded by so great clouds of witnesses, let us lay aside every weight and the sin which so easily ensnared us and let us run with endurance the race that is set before us. Let us run with endurance. Let us run with endurance for this race that is in front of us. We are, um, we are in the spiritual Olympics. Y'all don't know. We in the spiritual warfare right now, if y'all don't know. 
if y'all don't know, if y'all are oblivious to what a spiritual warfare is, is when God sent out his angels and the devil does that too with his with his demons and we go to war. That's what that is. Jesus want us to have love, joy, and peace. Jesus want us to have love, joy, and peace. Is there more that I want to? <laughs> no, I, I don't. That's what we ask for in relationships. Love, joy, and peace. You can't give me love, joy, and peace. The door. <laughs> like, you can't give me love, joy, and peace. First of all, number one, love, joy, and peace have to come from within. You can't love yourself. How you gonna love somebody else? If you don't have joy, how you gonna how you gonna if you don't have joy, that's a person who takes away other people's joy. If you don't have peace, that's a person who gonna take away your peace. Like I don't know, I I need peace. Somebody who got love, joy, and peace within them, like how I do. You know, yeah, like that. <laughs> Like, bro, like, bro, like, how, how, how is it going to work? Like, how is it going to work? Stop. Jesus wants us to have love, joy, and peace. Jesus and our father are one. <laughs> like how I said in the first, in the first. In the first video, in my very first video, um, I like this, I like this, and I really, really, really like this. Um, Jesus had authority to direct our lives, and he stood of us. Hold on, y'all, let me turn on this light. And he still does. He still does. Has authority over us. He's the messenger. Matthew chapter 5, 10 and 12 says, Blessed are those who are persecuted for righteousness. Sake, for there is the kingdom of heaven. Blessed are you when they revive, when they revive and persecute you and say all kinds of kinds of evil against you falsely for my sake who rejoice and exceedingly glad for great is your reward in heaven thank you jesus thank you god for so they persecute the prophets who were before you mm. 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 <laughs> Let me stop. But um, that speaks for itself. That speaks for itself. Blessed are those who are persecuted. Mm, 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 mm. Blessed are you when they revive and persecute you. Mm. Say all kinds of evil against you. Bless you. When you got people falsely saying things about your name, bless you. God bless you. Those who are persecuted, bless you. Those who want to get out of a situation and y'all are afraid to get out of it, bless you. Y'all in a marriage y'all don't want to be in, bless you. Children who can't escape, bless you.
from from the silent voices, the silent screams. God bless them. The silent cries. Bless them. Rejoice and exceedingly glad, for great is your reward in heaven. For so they persecute the prophets who were before you. A lot of people get it messed up. <clears throat> and God always told me to never brag about what you do in private. Never, never brag about what you did in private. You're not supposed to show your left hand what your right hand doing, Jesus said. And I stood on that, and I, I, and literally in a time at the time of my life when I I got that message. Like almost every time I get a message, something happened, and I'd be like, "Whoa, God told me that!" <laughs> like for real, like I'm a, that that happens almost every time, and it it happens it happens to me it happened to me all my life, and that's how I know that. And I always knew that he was real. <laughs> I always knew that he was real because, <laughs> like, even when I was a like, little girl in church, like, I was little. <laughs> I was so young. And we, my grew up in church. And we were so young. And I was like, oh my God. <laughs> the man in church said, <laughs> he said that was going to happen. He said that was going to happen. It happened. Oh my God. Like, if I, if I ask, if I ask God that this is what, if I ask God about this, he gonna do it. Oh my God, he did it. Like, <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much. <laughs> um, but that let me that uh, he led me to John chapter ten, um, verse thirty, and it says. <laughs> It's small, it's short. It says, um, I and my father are one. And I don't know why that hit me so hard because um, I do have a hypostatic union. Um, I'm not bragging, but I am God's child. I am my father's daughter. I am. <laughs> um... Matthew, which led me, which led me to Matthew chapter 28 and 18. And it says, Jesus came and spoke to them, said, saying, All authority has been given to me in heaven and on earth. Hold on, y'all, my baby. Say hi. <laughs> Say hi. <laughs> Why you look like that? Mm -hmm. Say hi. <laughs> Say hi. Look. Look, yes. <laughs> Okay, let me finish this word. Let me finish this word. 24 minutes. Oh my goodness. Um, okay. Um, uh, you look. Yes. Um, which led me also to Proverbs. And, and I'm in this, um, in this video. Um, Proverbs 3 and 9. 3 chapters. <laughs> um, chapter... 3 and 9, verse 9, and it says, <clears throat> oh, Honor the Lord with your possessions and with the first fruit and of all your increases. 
So, pretty much what that is saying is honor him in everything you do. Everything you do. Everything you have. And to glory be to God. To glory be to God. Yes. <laughs> Indeed. Excuse me. Jeez. Um. But yeah. We uh. We out. Uh. The Heavenly Father, thank you. Thank you for allowing me to make another, to go beast mode. <laughs> to go beast mode one more time. Thank you. Thank you for life, health, and strength. Thank you for my viewers. Thank you for my supporters. Um, thank you for your children, God. Thank you for your children. Bless their families. Bless their hearts. Bless them financially, bless them emotionally, physically. Give them life, health, and give them life, health, and strength, God. Allow their days to be yay. Yay. Allow their days to be blessed. Bless. Amen.